come with me and you'll see inside enchanted mirror tarot look inside you can't hide from enchanted mirror tarot welcome pisces this is pisces month ahead tarot reading whenever you find this this is your reading um so we have the eight of wands in the reverse I don't see things going the right way and I feel like there's a lot of delays and frustrations in your career it's not heading in the right direction I feel very bound by this I feel like you know you've made some mistakes but you won't own up to those I feel very weak and powerless here there's a lack of ambition in your career, and I don't feel like you're doing things the right way. Your heart's just not into it the way that it used to be. You're very stuck in the past. You're un you're uh, being unrealistic, naive. You're not looking through these illusions. And I feel like in your life, you didn't take the necessary time to heal, to go within. And there's two major life events side by side here in your life. I, I feel like you're not healing here in the month ahead in your life. You're going the, there's, you're going the wrong way. There's a loss of faith. You're fearing what tomorrow might bring two major life events back to back. I see that everything started right here. It all started right here. We can make some adjustments and get this into the right direction. However, I feel like either way in your career, there's going to be conflict moving forward. I see that your wishes will be fulfilled in your life. You have the wish fulfillment card, but you have to be very cautious that you're not overindulging because if you overindulge, it causes everything else to go topsy-turvy. And I see that's exactly what you're doing. You're overindulging. It's causing you to go the wrong way. There's delay, there's frustration, but I see things can come in very fast, especially communication. If you go the right way, if you don't overindulge, because your wishes are going to be fulfilled. There is hope here. There is hope here moving forward. There's some deep roots you're changing. You're changing and you're going to be moving forward. I do see you moving forward here. Your wishes are going to be fulfilled. We have eight and nine. There's a progression here in your life. You're growing old. You're growing old. And you know what? You need to own up to the mistakes that you've made in your career. You know, yeah, you made some mistakes. You're human. Life is boring without taking risks. <clears throat> and I see that you had to do what you had to do in order to grow. Now you've learned those lessons and you're sitting in a power seat. You've attained the top, the top of your career. There is hope. Your wishes are being fulfilled and things are coming in really fast. You're growing old, but age brings wisdom. Instead of letting it cripple you, hold you back, you need to go within and take some necessary time to rest and reflect. You've grown very, very old. And I see that, you know, there is a new dawn around on the horizon once you d dive into these secrets. It's something that you just need to do. Journal. Definitely journal. And I see in your career that you're being very unrealistic, naive. You need to look back on the past and reevaluate where it's brought you, what you've done in your career, what works, what doesn't, and grow from that. Grow from this wisdom that you've created by making mistakes, by growing older. And then I see that you're going to have a period of relief. 
There's a relief from struggle, a time to heal, a rebalancing. And I definitely see this in Aquarius season. Um, absolutely, you're going to be healing because you have these deep roots in Aquarius season. In your relationship, you need to trust. You need to trust. There's transformations that are occurring through acceptance. Once you escape your current situation, it will automatically transform. I do see a couple here. I do see you being in a couple here. The person's very dark. This is a very, look at the face. It's very dark in the shadows. This is somebody from your past. I don't see this as being somebody new. Somebody from your past is coming in for you. And they're watching you. There's a lot of desire here. I see that <clears throat> this person is not working. Um, they, they may be unemployed. There's some sort of insecurity here. They're not working on this. They're not working on this. I don't see them working on this. They could. And I do see that there's a potential here of a castle of happiness, of stability, if they would work on this. But I don't see that they're doing that. Especially if it's a uh, Libra or Scorpio or Sagittarius. I don't see them working on this. I wish I could take back my words. Virgo. Virgo real in Pisces. I wish I could take back my words. I keep myself sacred, a place only you can enter. I'm granting you access once inside. You'll never wish to leave. I do see love here. They wish that they could take back their words. I see in your life things are happening fast. We have money that wants to come in. Money wants to come in here, a relationship, something stable and long-term wants to come in. But I feel like there were some mistakes that were made, and it happened presently. It happened presently, and I feel like moving forward, you need to be very realistic in your expectations and take some time. Allow, allow divine guidance to come in. I do see a couple in the future. I see a lot of love. I see a lot of financial stability. I see you really breaking through, breaking out. You're being guided, there's deep roots here. You're transforming into something very beautiful. I do see a couple. I definitely see a couple here in the future. There's a lot of happiness here. I feel like there's somebody watching you. Look, these sides of the faces, that one's covered and that one's covered. This is Libra. This is Scorpio. So in between Libra and Scorpio season, I see, I see something's going to be, some sort of secrets are going to be revealed that's going to guide you forward and transform you into something very beautiful. 
your wishes are going to be fulfilled. All right. If you enjoyed that and you'd like to see more, please consider subscribing to my channel. Also, uh, please like, comment, share. It does help support this channel. Thank you so much, Pisces. Have a wonderful month ahead.